All right, this is a quick video of a pick I just got. Um, Jim Dunlop Prime Tone Sculpted Plectra 1.4. It comes in a three pack. Um, I think I paid like $8.95 uh, for it. I just got it from, oh, Sweetwaters. And by the way, just for the record, if you ever get anything from Sweetwaters, they give you candy. It came in this nice little box thingy. Um, hey, I gotta go buy a guitar from that place if they did this for $8.95. I um, wonder what they'll do for if I buy a real guitar. So, anyway, though, so I wanted to AB this against, I call it the Granddaddy. This is my favorite pick. Everybody knows these. Uh, my blue chip Tad 50. And this is the exact same shape. Somebody mentioned it in the forum, so I said, let me try this stuff. All right. And if you put them up together, they're basically the same size. Exact same size. It's a little bit bevel size. So let's hear how they sound next to each other. And I'll you know, talk a little bit about how they feel. So first, the uh, Jim Dunlin Prime Time. Or I should say Prime Tone. Chip tap fifty. Jim Donlop again. Okay, Jim Donlop now. Chip. Jazz playing on the Jim Donlop.
some thoughts about some of this stuff. So, so this is actually a very, very, very good pick. But the blue chip is still much better than this. Um, I mean, I don't know if you can hear the difference in tones. A lot of um, tone is preference. Uh, this has a feel to it, like in the middle. It feels good, but it also kind of feels cheap. Don't get me wrong. It just very lightweight to it. I like heavier things. I like heavier strings, sturdy guitar. Um, and the blue chip, it just feels right. There's something about it. Despite the fact that this has ridges in the middle, right? This is still easier, and I still feel like I have a lot more control. So when I'm playing jazz runs off this uh, blue chip. It feels effortless. It feels like I don't have something in my hand. It just, and that's the mark of a good pick if you play cello or any bowed instrument. That's the mark of a good bow, something that's like a natural extension of you. This, it feels good. It doesn't feel bad. This would probably be one of the better picks out there, but not as natural as the blue chip. There's almost a little something, a little plasticky about it. And this one is... fine age wine or of scotch like really smooth um kind of nice top end uh, bottom and this is like a little brighter hasn't matured yet good pick though but i like the blue chip a little bit better so there you have it Jim Dunlap 1.4 versus the blue chip tab 50.